in this video, I'm going to tell you what I would do if I had to build my physique all over again in 2024. So, I am going to share with you the four things that I would do so I can achieve that goal. If you don't know who I am, I am Ahmed. I have been training for more than four years. I'm a natural bodybuilder. I did over a thousand workouts. And my mission is to help young men to build their physique to have a better quality of life. So the first thing is understanding that building your physique is a long-term thing. So bodybuilding is not for the impatient. You have to be patient with the results that you're going to get in the future. So if you do not see results after two weeks, do not say, I'm never going to train again. I don't see any progress. This is not for me. No, two weeks is not enough for you to build muscle. You need more than that. So you need one month, two months, three months, so you can begin even seeing some progress. So some people are hard gainers. Some people can gain so much muscle in a very short period of time. So it depends on genetics, but even if you have bad genetics, just wait some time and do not think, okay, I must get this amount of muscle in this amount of time, or I should lose this amount of fat in this amount of time. Because what happens is that you don't achieve that goal. So do not think short term, think long term. So rather than saying, I'm going to achieve this amount of muscle mass, or I'm going to lose this amount of weight in one month, instead, say, I am going to make this amount of muscle, and I'm going to lose this amount of fat in one year. That is a realistic goal, and you're going to have so much time so you can reach your dream physique. And please, do not say, I want to achieve my dream physique in three months. You are going to build so much muscle and lose so much fat in three months, but you are still not going to achieve your dream physique. The second thing I would do is that I would use the HIT training method. So HIT means high intensity training and that is doing one set of high intense controlled reps until failure that is the best method that i have came across in my entire fitness journey because when i used to do the three sets of 15 or the four sets of 12 my progress was very very slow but when i started to do this method I saw my progress was just amazing. Like, I would literally see my muscle mass increasing after one day of rest, after training. This is, this is a crazy. Like, I only train, like, 30 minutes to an hour, and I get results after one day. And right now, I wish I could have known this method from a very young age and I wish that I could have applied it very very young because it has given me so much results in a very very short period of time so of course I told you that you have to wait so you can achieve your dream physique I did this method and I saw so much results in a very short period of time but I still didn't reach my dream physique because my dream physique is something big it's like my dream physique is something very extraordinary so maybe maybe if you did this method you can actually reach your dream physique so much faster so i'm not saying that you're going to achieve your dream physique in three months i'm saying this is the best method and it will make you reach your dream physique faster at least that's what worked for me the third thing is focusing on progressive overload. So progressive overload is doing more than what you did before. That's it. Do more than before. It's a very simple term. So if today I did 30 kilos of tricep extensions and I did 10 reps, the next time when I train, I'm going to do 11 to 12. The next time I train after that, I'm going to do 12 to 30 and so on until I reach my dream physique. So progressive overload is doing more than before. And let's say I reach to 17 to 20 reps 
with doing 30 kilos of tricep pushdowns. Then I'm going to increase the weight slightly, so I might do 32 or 34 kilos, and then I'm going to start again from the number of reps that I started with. So it's very, very simple. Do more than before. Lastly, I would focus on my diet. So, if I want to bulk up, I would do a calorie surplus, which means I'm bulking. If I want to lose weight, means that I'm so fat, I'm cutting down. So, it depends on your goal. If you're skinny, then you should bulk up. If you're fat, then you should cut down. So, how do I gain muscle if I'm bulking up or cutting down? I try to take one gram of protein per pound of body weight. So I'm 150 pounds. That means I should get 150 grams of protein. But sometimes I couldn't get the amount of protein needed from food. And so I would have supplements. So the supplement that I used to have was protein powder. So because I couldn't take the amount of protein needed from food, I took it from supplements. And sometimes I still couldn't get the amount of protein needed from food and also the supplement. And so many people say, I can't get the amount of protein needed from food or I can't get the amount of protein needed in the day. And I had this problem where I couldn't get the amount of protein needed from food and supplements. And so I said in my brain, I'm still going to build muscle. So do not think, okay, if I don't get this amount of protein needed in a day, I would never build muscle. No, you will build muscle. You will actually have a better physique than before. But of course, you're going to build more muscle if you took the amount of protein needed. But if you couldn't, that's okay. So I've told you what I would do personally if I had to build my physique all over again in 2024. Now, if you want to learn on how you can actually implement all of what I just said in this video, then go check out my program. So I have three coaching calls with you so I can help you with anything that you have. And I help you in terms of what exercise should you do, what diet should you choose. And there's so many bonuses for you so you can actually progress towards your goal. If you found this video helpful, then my program is going to help you even more. So go check it out. Click and watch this. See you in the next video.